I was thrown out of home in my late teens. I was staying with my uncle, who happens to be a chief, and uh, wanted me to come along with the performance of some traditional rituals. Around 93, things became very difficult and I needed additional intervention. 2007, both my parents died. Things became difficult for me. By then I was in Form 2. I had to go to fishing at night. Life has not been easy for me. My dad being unemployed and my mom. My brother used to take care of me. By both points, he was also unemployed, so he had to stop taking care of me. Central Aid is um, a charity organization. It is more or less the corporate social responsibility arm of the church, International Central Gospel Church. Central Aid has been operating for about 30 years. We started with providing financial assistance to brilliant but needy Ghanaians. So from the time of its inception up to now, um, over 5,500 people have benefited from this program. Shortly after the scholarship scheme was established, we added other areas of intervention in the area of education, health and social welfare. And we've really contributed to the socioeconomic development of our dear nation. Our focus is on the Central University and members of the church. Going forward, we want to give the scholarship to people who have applied to the Central University who would have qualified. Once that is done, then they will apply to Central Aid. One day, my teacher was going through her daily graphic and she saw Central Aid um, scholarship scheme. She, she was on me, so T. Manuel, apply for this, apply for this. A relative told me of Central Aid in 2014 and then encouraged me to apply. I was in ICGC, uh, but I had not uh, been too familiar with Central Aid. So someone drew my attention to that and I applied. And God being so good, I was given the uh, scholarship. Somebody from my church paid my admission fees for me. And after that, I applied for the Central Aid Scholarship and they also came through and paid all my fees from day one through to the end. For every individual that was sponsored, if it were not for Central Aid, there would have been a gap. Either they wouldn't be what they are today or they would have been something else. I would appeal that we as pastors, church leaders, will have to come on board and mobilize our members to become more conscious about Central Aid about the social mandate of the church, a community development programs, and let members support. So we'll be looking into the church and finding out individuals in the church who will be able to sponsor, and also businesses in the church who will also be interested in sponsoring, and even other church groups within the church, so that instead of only focusing on the church, the local assemblies alone, other people in the church who have the capacity um, to donate can also come on board because this is our program and we need to make it a success. In going into the future, we'll continue to expand our operations but also strengthen the scholarship scheme. Uh, we have started with Central University. With time, we would let it cover other brilliant but needy students beyond Central University. We also intend to go into other areas, medical outreaches, and then also into the community development. If it hadn't been for uh, Central Aid, I wouldn't have been there. Had it not been them, I wouldn't have reached my secondary level. If Central Aid hadn't come to my help, I would have still been an SHS graduate, working to be able to cater for my university education. They've helped me so much in my education and other things. I thank them for all that they've done for me. I'd like to thank Dr. Mensa Utabel for his vision of bringing Central Aid Scholarship. Yeah, I want to thank ICGC, the organization that had given me the opportunity to express my ministry. I say a very big thank you for supporting every one of us, from me to the least beneficiary of this scheme. In 1991, it was a time when things were tough, the need was there, and having a church step in at a very important time in my life made a difference. Who knows, maybe I wouldn't be managing director. For Central Aid, I will continue to pray for you 
I would be a campaigner and advocate for central aid. That would be how to express my appreciation. That I want to say thank you very much. To sign up, pick up a sponsor's form at the information desk, complete and submit the sponsor's form as per given instructions. Payment options for mobile money use 0242-008087 or 0242-008092. For online, visit www.centraladegh.org and for direct payment, pay to GCB Bank, Tema Industrial Area, account number 109-113-000-9533. Checks should be payable to Central Aid. Whoever is kind to the poor lends to the Lord and he will reward them for whatever they have done. Proverbs 19, 17.